It was 2.31 and I was laying in bed because I was super bored because, you know, staying at home is very boring. But then I remembered I had soup downstairs, my absolute favorite food ever. So I ran downstairs and then I went in the fridge and I saw that my soup was still there and I was so happy because nobody ate it. And I poured it into the bowl and it kind of looked like baby puke or baby food, but it's okay. Warmed up my potato soup for two minutes and then I ate it. It was really good and then it was gone in like three seconds. Kind of sad, but it's okay. And then the next day I was laying in bed trying to do laundry and I was super tired and I hadn't eaten yet. And then I remember there was soup downstairs, not the same soup. I already ate all that soup, but then I found this soup packet. So I decided to make that. All you have to do is add water. And then I saw that there's little noodles in it and I was like, uh oh, gluten. That's probably gonna kill my stomach if there's gluten in it, but hey, it's okay. I was starving. I was eating some gluten free banana bread and then my cat was like meowing so loud. So I opened the door and then I offered him some banana bread and he actually wanted to eat it. And I was like, you can't eat banana bread, you're a cat. I had to pour the soup and then it had a little spaz attack and splattered all over me. It kind of hurt, but hey, it was okay. And then I put pepper in my soup and I tasted it. It was so hot. Why do I taste boiling things? As I was eating it, I was like, okay, this soup is too good to be true. It tastes so good. So I went to check the ingredients and yes, there was wheat in it. It was the very first ingredient, which was so sad. I put my soup in the sink. I cried a little bit, went upstairs, and then I went to bed.